Museum of Art and Science of Milan, where the exhibition of Alexander Kanevsky's paintings take place. Psychomorphism, the phenomenology that I have described five years ago, um, is depicted in this, uh, illustrated in this painting that I have made in 2008, called The Bird and the Fish. And as you see, some of us look like birds, some of us look like fishes, some of us look like lions, some of us like cats, some of us like dogs, like elephants, rats, and so forth. Psychomorphism is merely a translation of our psychic world upon our physical appearance. This is Judas, and Judas is produced in 1995. It's one of the few paintings that are not painted by oil, but by acrylic on wood. And Judas is now as, an, as if in the crypt of his soul, in the prison of his guilt squeezed between two immutable, gray, mural-like elephants. And there are the judges making decisions upon the fates. This is Rape of Sabines, painted in 2010. Reflection upon the classical subject which has been produced in a variety of pieces of art in the past, having perchance a neoclassical twist of my own interpretation. Rape of Sabines. And this is a photograph, the name of this painting. And as you see, it's rather a strange photograph, but it is strange that perchance this is a piece of subjective consciousness or unconsciousness depicted within one second or one moment of the time. Or perchance this is a photograph upon which we're looking not objectively from outside but subjectively from the inside. Or let us call it a photograph from the inside. Or you may have better interpretation than mine, and no less veritable one. 